G'day everyone, long time no see. Me and the old boy, we've travelled to New South Wales and we're doing a charity ride here in Orange, New South Wales. Charity. What is it? Just a fucking... I'm a negative bike ride. Just a bike ride, it's not charity. Um, Bicycle Network set it up and it's just a ride, basically. Um, we're doing 70Ks, 10.30pm, night before. We've been to the pub, we've had a few beers, we've had a feed. I'm just getting stuff together, getting ready to um, take on the ride tomorrow. So my old man hasn't he hasn't trained in about five weeks and the longest ride he's done is about 50 k's. So I'm doing the 70k ride with him. Um, they said it was undulating hills and false flats, but there's some real steep things in there. So it'll be good fun, it'll be exciting. So I thought I'd talk to you before I go to bed, and I'll catch you in the morning. Morning. So we just woke up. A little bit of a headache, but all good. We're just getting ready. Got the lights on, got the numbers on the bike. It's not a bad morning. A bit overcast. I think all the rain's gone though. There's rain on the roof of all the cars. That's about it. So we made it here. Pretty dark, a lot darker than what it looks on here. Bikes everywhere. Love it. Alright, they've just started letting off all the groups very slowly. Heaps of people, heaps of bikes. Should be fun. What do you reckon, Dad? Yeah, what? if I get over the first hill, we'll see. <laughs> Should be good. Speak soon. Big climb for the old boy. Where is he? It's going alright. Done just over 10 k's. A few hills. Feeling good just coasting with the old fella. Wherever he is. Just chauffeuring him to 70 k's today. This is amazing right now. It's so foggy. Like going down this steep as hill. I hate going down hills and I'm filming, what an idiot, but it's so foggy. It's beautiful. Check it out, I'll show you. A third of the way, we've done 30 k's. How you feeling? Uh, better go down than up. <laughs> We're getting in. We're going right. So, the roads are still pretty wet, which will make it easy. Um, pretty cruising drive at the moment, we've made a few hills, but it's been good fun so 
the bar. Back on. Thank you, thank you. Haha, <laughs> I'm crazy. Alright. stop go to the loo we're in a little place called cargo little country town there you go mate and um yeah dad's just taken off up ahead so gonna catch him but he's going pretty good he's sweating it up and um earning it that's for sure but it's just good fun just cruising i'm literally just turning the legs over trying to keep him motivated hanging with him and um, yeah, the sun's out now. So, beautiful, beautiful day. Anyway, I'll see you at the finish line. We got just done 50 k's, so we only got another 20 to go. Um, and that'll be it. It's been good fun. I've never been to Orange before. The story is my, um, my grandfather grew up to the age of 18 in orange as a cyclist and um, moved to Melbourne because the cycling scene was better and followed his coach so that's the story so we thought we'd do father-son trip do a bit of a ride check out where he used to live and um, that's about it really but I'll just keep spinning, little Ned Kelly, and um, catch us at the finish line. How you travelling? Oh, pretty good yourself. Yeah, good mate. How's it go up hills? Oh, a little bit slower than you. Yeah. But um, a bit faster downhill. Yep. The aerodynamics are a bit better. I saw you scoot past before, you are flying. Yeah, I got to um, down that big hill at Lidstar. Yep. Past Nashdale. Yep. Um, I can do 81.3. Oh, flying. How's it go? Like, is it, you know, sketchy or does it feel alright? That feels good. Yeah. Very oh, well. comfortable. Yeah. You're going to have a sore ass, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> uh, we got a crowd coming up behind us. That's it. Alright. Alright, see you later. Catch you, mate. Enjoy. Every time we talk, we make a mess. Everything you say sounds like a friend. So we just did this really fast descent. Not really, but like 70 k's an hour-ish. Maybe 60, I don't know. But there was one section, there was about easily 30 drink bottles within like 50 meters of each other. Sketchy as these New South Wales roads, I tell ya. They need a lift out here. Whatever. Pushed up the big hill, just under five, just under five k's to go, I think. Check out this valley, though. Amazing. So beautiful out here. The wind, there's barely any wind. It's probably actually zero wind. But um, 
been good. Dad's done pretty good. Pushing himself. Just told him he has to now go for 100k. Done his 70. Now I'll go for 100. It's just breathtaking the scenery out here. It's beautiful. Anyway. I'll catch you at the finish line. Just coming through the finish line. Woohoo! Yay! He did it. He didn't think he was going to. How are you feeling, Dad? Uh, pretty knackered. <laughs> Can't believe it, actually. He's done well. In training, he's only done maybe high 40 k's. So he's done well. Five weeks, not really riding. Awesome fun. So, Chris, we only did the 70 k off. We've got to put our bikes in these trucks. Jump on one of these bad boys. Take us back to have a beer. <laughs> Too easy. Catch it back at the velodrome. This bus is going to stink. Brand new today. It's <laughs> the first journey. Beautiful. Yep. Yep, to see you, mate. Beauty. Thanks, buddy. Cheers, mate. Hope you enjoyed your ride. Thank you. I've spruced up. Dad's in the shower. We're just going to get some um, clothes on and head back down to the velodrome to see all the guys that did the big 170 come in and have a beer and some food and check out the shenanigans that's going on there. So, yeah, it was a good day. Um, good fun. Beautiful scenery. Hills. Fog, a bit of rain, a bit of heat, it was everything. But um, yeah, can't wait to clean the bike because she's so dirty. Anyway, um, I'll show you some action down the velodrome. No one to blame, there's no one to blame. Well, it's easy to forget what you learn. Five hours, 57. Yeah. Well, I wanted to break the six hours. I thought I was looking at the thing. I thought, oh, I think I'm going to do it. Yeah. We must have rolled out a bit after seven. Yep. Well done. Yes, I'm happy now. <laughs> <laughs> It'll work, buddy. <laughs> Go get a beer, eh? I will. So, that's it for the day, really. For you guys, anyway. I'm, um... We're off to the pub, watch some footy, some rugby, some cricket, whatever they got going, have some food, and we head back to Melbourne tomorrow. So I'll catch you during the week at some stage, I'm sure. Maybe I'll get a race in on Tuesday night or Thursday night. See you then.